Toby, hello. Um, do you think you can still turn this tie around? And if you do win and stay in the competition, will it ultimately help or hinder your Premier League title chances? I think um, it's going to be difficult, of course. Um, but there is, there is always a chance, I think. Um, we have to give 100% tomorrow and uh, we'll see uh, how far it brings us. But at, at the lane, uh, yeah, everything is possible, I think. So, but I think we have to play better than last week. How easy or difficult is it to switch away from the Premier League at the moment when it's building to such a climax? I mean, did you, for example, watch the Leicester game? What, what, what did you make of it? I couldn't watch the, the game. Of course, you follow it. Um, no, it's not so difficult because we try to see game by game, try to um, prepare ourselves the best way possible for the next game um, and don't look too much uh, uh, to the competition, I mean to the, to the stand, how, how it is. We try to win every game and we'll see uh, how far we can go. Two more goals of the weekend for Harry Kane. Just, just how good is his form at the moment? Is he the best striker in the Premier League, for example? I think he's very good. I think he's a very good striker. Um, for us, uh, he works. In, he's not only scoring, but working for the team as well. So that's very important. And um, of course, he's helping us. And uh, I think every player in the team is, is trying to do their best. And, and, and it helps us, of course, that, uh, that Harry Kane is uh, giving us the goals. So far in this competition, you've won four out of four at home, averaging three goals a game. But that's the bare minimum, isn't it, tomorrow night? You've got to get at least three, whatever happens. Yeah, it, it's difficult to um, to think what's going to happen tomorrow. You never know if you score an early goal or something. And a lot of things can happen, but we try to do our best and give 100%. That's, that's all we can do. More questions? Thank you. Um, so uh, some have suggested that the Premier League now is a two-horse race just between yourself and Leicester City. What do you make of that? No, I don't think so because every week um, there are crazy results. So uh, I think the, the, the Premier League is changing every week again. So no, I think uh, it's, um, it's, it's difficult to, to keep up, you know, but... Um, we don't, we don't want to see too much to the other teams. We want to try to focus to our own and uh, our own games. And that's the most important thing. And you're up against a team tomorrow who are doing a good job of balancing the Europa League and their domestic championship as well in Dortmund. Yeah, yeah, they have a fantastic team. Uh, I think they, um, they play very well against us as well. But uh, we want to show something tomorrow that um, it's, it's a shame that one game um, we're not playing at the level we are used to play. So it's a shame that it's 3-0. We do want to show something tomorrow. Any more questions for Toby at all? Yeah. Camera at the back. Easier with the microphone. Okay. Toby, sorry. On the, you mentioned about the three 0 Obviously, as a defender, is is it part of your personal pride that you want to respond to the bad results in Germany? Not only my personal pride, but I think the pride of the team. You know, I think we didn't play well that match. So um, we want to prove something tomorrow and, uh, and play much better. I think we can play much better. And, um, and let's do this tomorrow. I've read you talking about your head coach, the man sat to your left, saying that he gives this team a great deal of belief. How much belief do you need to have ahead of this game to, to believe that you can progress? Yeah, of course we have the belief because we know about our game. It was not our best game. So... Um, yeah, we believe, and like I said, everything can happen at the lane, and with the, with the fans behind us. And uh, I think we have to play our best football. But um, I'm, I'm confident in that that we can uh, show something tomorrow. How are you not tired, you as an individual and Spurs as a team? You've played so much football already this season. Because we had a, a very tough uh, pre-season, and, uh, and we work every day very hard to keep uh, keep us body fit, and we do uh, all sorts of tests and 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 and. and and things to keep us fit, you know, and uh, and try to live as a, a real professional. That's very important. Um, or only focus in my life, I think, of the life of the players is football, nothing else. And um, I think we have a very professional group, and that's why we keep playing this game. Hi, guys. Barnaby from Spurred On outside Villa Park. We just beat Aston Villa 2-0. Gets us back to winning ways after a few games without a win, both in the uh, 